Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today we are going to show you Aisha sister's video. Mashallah, she converted to Islam. She is going to explain us about one thing that happens when you become a Muslim. Let's see her video now. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh by Shirazli. This is a bit more of an informal video, but it's something that's really important that I just have to tell you guys about. There is one thing that happens to you when you become Muslim which no one tells you about, like no one talks about this. That thing is that your self-control just skyrockets. It skyrockets. There's a couple of reasons this happened and there's a lot of perks that come with it. Since I've become Muslim, I my productivity has just gone through the roof. I am so productive, alhamdulillah. I get so much of my days done. My day has turned into five days. One of the main things that we're taught in Islam is self-control. With our like, with the self-control that we have because of what we've been taught in our religion of all the fasting, getting up for fudge every day, all the controlling desires, that self-control that we're taught transcends into our workplace, transcends into our family life, transcends into everything we do, our studying. Every single thing we do, we bring that self-control into and we end up getting more done. And this self-control is honestly the key to any success. The key to any success is this, is building this self-control to beat your desires and do what's actually better for you. And every single guru, motivational speaker, everyone in the West will tell you this. And Islam teaches this. Look, I'm going to be honest, all these motivational speakers and stuff, they'll be like, control your desires, get up early, work hard, don't give up. They will say this stuff to you but they don't give you any practical exercises to actually train yourself to do these things. Islam does. Islam gives you the exercises every single day. It says, you wanna get stuff done? You wanna be successful in this world and the hereafter? You, you gotta get up for fajr, you gotta fast. You gotta control your desires. We are given practical exercises to do every single day to teach us to be successful. And that's why all of us as Muslims, we have insane potential because we have so much self-control, alhamdulillah. And with that self-control, take it into your workplace, take it into your passion, do the best you can and show everyone that us Muslims, we are, we can achieve anything, alhamdulillah. Because we've also got Allah on our sides, alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah. I love you guys so much. I hope you gained something from this. Let me know. Thank you for watching. Assalamu alaikum. I totally agree with Aisha's sister, mashallah. Aisha's sister is absolutely right. Look, faith makes us strong. Salah makes us punctual. Fast teaches us self-control. Charity teaches us to be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And pilgrimage brings unity and equality. Our deen is so beautiful, mashallah. Much love. Take care.